Had it, folks. Well, it's back to reality. And luckily, after the long weekend and the amazing meetup we had at Ten Killer Lake, Mid America YouTube meetup, like I said, it's back to reality. Now, luckily for Pooch, he's off this week. He's got stuff to do, things to take care of, and work on. But, of course, we left this place in shambles when we left. Pretty and I were making shirts, all kinds of stuff to take, and just look at this mess. I don't know if y'all can see all this, but we left this place in a freaking mess, which is typical when you're out in the sweatshop. It's, it's all the time, shirts, transfers, boxes of shirts, you name it. But there's another thing, because we've had so much rain lately that the grass has gotten tall too. And that's something Pooch has got to work on today. He's got to get the grass cut. Now we rain, had rain again last night, a little bit, not a whole lot, but you know, being that I usually mow on the weekends and of course I was gone this weekend, kind of got a, it got a little bit of a head start on Pooch. And that's fine and pretty. It's cloudy, overcast, sun's out, but I got to get out here and get after it because you let this stuff out here get out of hand, it'll work a mower over and it'll wear one out quick because Pooch has done that before. But as you can tell, a lot of that stuff, wildflowers, whatnot, it's definitely starting to grow so um pooch is about to get busy now i know y'all don't want to see a bunch of mowing and all that crap but i ain't doing that but anyway i had to get a video started so this is the start to my video man even this crap behind the little barn there all oh, that weed i might set that on fire <laughs> yeah i don't know but we do need to get on the mower and get her cranked up get her fired up and start cutting some grass and probably have to drag the weed eater out but uh anyway pooch was yesterday editing his own videos to put up and of course he was watching all you other folks and y'all's videos y'all put up Got to get caught up on all angles, you know. Why are I watching in there? That stereo playing. It'll get some music, and I'll get a dadgum copyright. I don't need any of that. I ain't never had one yet, and I don't want one either. Usually what I'll do is I'll throw the headphones on. But let's turn that thing down and keep talking till I shut it up. There we go. I'll check this out. Now, I haven't haven't placed all of them up yet. I got a few to show off, but pooch shop fridge is getting loaded. I've got more to put on. I actually had some doubles of some stickers. So I thought, well, I'll go ahead and get them on and I'll save the others. But the old shop fridge is getting full of stickers. And by the time I add the other ones I got, I think all this will be filled in. And for you folks that have stickers and you haven't sent Pooch one yet, go ahead and get him one. Throw it in the mail or something. Send it to him so you can get on the shop fridge. <laughs> All right. And, you know, Woody. Woody looked after the place while we was gone. And that's kind of crazy. And that's why he's out here on the porch. Usually folks come driving up our drive, which is a private drive. They get down here to the end of this row. It's not the end, but it's halfway through. And they realize 
well this road ain't going nowhere and then you look over this way and they see Woody standing here on the porch they second guess themselves they think it's somebody standing there half the time even people that have delivered stuff and thought that was somebody standing there but kind of a little bit of extra security I need to get one of them signs and hang up by him. I don't call 911. <laughs> Good job, Woody. You're doing it right out here. But anyway, Pooch is about to get on the mower fired up and he's gonna get after it so he can get some mowing done. So um, till I get in with you again, I ain't gonna make you watch me mow, but Pooch needs to get after it. Yes, sir. Now Pooch needs to do a couple things to get himself ready to go here. First things first, of course, I gotta get that pinch between my cheeks and gum. You know, Pooch is calm down. Next, I got to get the old earbuds and the phone synced. Because you know Pooch has got to listen to his music. And he loves that outlaw country music while he's mowing. So let's get these things put in. And next, we got to get the Pandora on. All right. Yep. Frank Foster, for you folks that want to know what Pooch listens to, check him out. All right. Yep. Looks like all the cows came home again. Mm -hmm. 
Hey, Woody, how about you go mow? Oh, I'm doing fine standing right here supervising. Well, um, we're at my place. And your hand, your hired hand. So how about you go mow? Well, if I don't, if I go mow, who's going to watch over the camp? I'll watch over the camp, Woody. Dang it. He ain't going to mow. Guess I need to get back after it. Yes, sir. Well, it's the next day. I didn't quite get it all the land mowed, but I got most of it. Ran out of gas, actually. Didn't have no more gas to put in the, the zero turn, so that kind of limited my ability to finish. But I got most of it, except for that half over there, that side. And of course, then we had some rain overnight. So that's got it all damp. So Pooch is trying to figure out what's he going to get into next. I got a good idea. I'm thinking about going over to the lake and trying to get a little fishing in. That seems to be the best option. So um, Pooch is pondering it. It's nice out. I don't think we're going to get any more rain for a while today, but it's pretty nice out right now. So that may be what I need to do. It's just go, go try my luck at doing a little fishing. Looking over there in the pasture out to the west. And gosh dang it. Looks like the cows are coming home. <laughs> oh no. Let's see if um I think they're coming home. So you know what that means when the cows come home. Anyway, Pooch is going to uh, go grab his gear and I think he's going to head to the lake. So let's go. Get them in here. She'll never know. I'll be back, pretty. I gotta go get some gas so I can finish mowing. Kevin, at Hiking with Jackie Boy, are these mylar berries? 
I don't know. Something I hate to see out here. Good Lord. What's wrong with people? But. This might be the spot. Let's check it and see. Now this shore beats working and mowing. You know, folks, even if I don't catch nothing, the sound of this peacefulness and the birds and the cool breeze in this shade is all worth it. Let me get a pinch between my cheek and gums. You know what pooch calls it. Let's get some calm down. And let's just sit here and enjoy the sounds for a bit. Yes, sir.
Well, it was fun and nice while it lasted. But uh, Pooch would probably better get back before he gets in trouble. still at work when I get home. If not, I know just the thing that might soothe things over. Could I get a large Texas chai? Look, pretty. I got your favorite tea. 